Alice Rucker's dead. What? Poisoned, I think. Holy shit, man. Rucker was the voice of the Augmented. People loved him for it. When word of this hits, Prague is gonna explode. And the whole world's watching. Listen, Miller's gone to meet with state police. Could be our chance to determine his loyalties. He lives near TF-29. You want us to search his apartment? Not us. Me. You keep digging into that Versalife break-in. And see what the Collective can dig up on a Victor Marchenko. If I'm right, and Rucker was poisoned, all three might be connected. Jensen out. Adam, you there? You're not gonna believe this, but Vadim Orloff is in Prague. You're kidding. I wish I were. Six months ago, he got an augmented expert's visa and has been coming and going periodically ever since. Border Control logged him in this morning. I arrived in Prague six months ago. Where is he staying? In the Lilioma Courtyard Apartments on Lavani Street, second floor. I'll check it out. Make the best of it, he says. What? She told you I am not sure. Can't defend against that kind of thing. Seraph, I found Orlov. He's dead. What? Are you sure it's him? Well, technically, I never met him before. I did, however, meet a doctor who looks just like him in Alaska. In that clinic I told you about? His name then was McFadden. Christ, Adam. What exactly happened to you in that clinic? I don't know. I was in the coma ward. It was run by the World Health Organization. Facility 451. Can you dig into it? Of course. I'm gonna search this body and the apartment, and see what I can find.
Trace program initiated. Access granted. Access granted.
We've taken away everything. Can't believe a word they say. Good luck finding the people who hacked us. Hopefully it will turn out to be nothing. Send me to check on my progress. Really, I said it would be done when it's done. You can't rush these things, Adam. Excellence takes time. Right. So, well, I was right. Am I good or am I good? What did you find? Oh, just some isolated fragments from what looks like the bomb's timing mechanism. And get this. It's a Stanic. A Stanic? The bomb's timing mechanism was a wristwatch? Well, to address your incredulous tone, a mechanical timing mechanism is not as silly as it sounds. Security scanners can detect anything with a suspicious electronic circuit, so... Using a low-tech solution is really clever. Stanic watches are custom-made locally. I think I'll pay the shop a visit. Hmm, it's probably closed. Let's see if I can find you a second option. Yeah, got it. Nomad Stanek, founder and owner of the store, lives in the Davnia Vod district near Pilgrim Station. That's Putnik Nadraji in Czech, I, I think. Building number 96, second floor. Nice, I'll check it out. Great, let me know how it goes. Maybe. Hey, Jensen, heard you had a bit of trouble at the petting zoo. Come again? The snatch and grab with Rucker. Guess it's no steps forward and two steps back for you too, eh? Isn't that how you put it before? Right. Only I'm not being tied up by red tape like you are. My problem is a little more complicated than that. I'm just stating the facts as they are, mate. Although, I am a little surprised you managed to cock up such a simple task, what with you being so, uh, well equipped for the job. You think because I'm augmented going after Rucker should have been a cakewalk? You know, McCready, the more I talk to you, the less surprised I am by what comes out of your head. Is that a fact? You think you know me? I know your type. You're a front towards enemy kind of soldier. Very effective, as long as someone points you in the right direction. I'll wear that as a compliment, thank you. And fuck you. Now, if you don't mind.
Why do you have such a problem with me, McCready? You don't even know me. Oh, I think I do. I've worked with your type before. You roll into barracks with your solid-state muscle, think you're more capable than the rest of us slobs. You're afraid of being replaced? <laughs> Please, mate. They broke the fucking mold when they made me. Besides, I think it's been proven that there's no substitute for good old-fashioned organic clockworks. So, again, if you don't mind, I have work to do. So no all can ever live down the incident, is that it? Is this meant to be an interrogation, Mr. Shit-Hot Ex-Cop? Because you're dancing on my last fucking nerve. You afraid it's gonna happen again? Listen, Frankenstein, I lost three men. Good men, because one of you fucking robots had his switch. I warned you about pushing it, didn't I? Still, that was unprofessional. Look. I just... We all lost something during the incident, some more than others. But the people responsible are still out there, and they need to answer for what they did. I'm not asking you to be friends, but we can't stop them as enemies. Mismatched tools, bound by a common goal. Is that it? Something like that, yeah. Hell, maybe that is all we need. Suppose we just let time tell. Right. I'll see you around, McCready. Sure. Adam. I heard about Rucker. That's terrible, Adam. He was our standard bearer. What direction will the movement take now? I don't know. I spoke to Miller as he was leaving. He told me he was going to Gollum City to talk to the state police. Damn, I hope he has better luck than you and Smiley did. Because if you think that Prague is bad now, imagine what'll happen if reaction to Rucker's death gets violent. I'd rather not. Yeah, Fubar is what'll happen. What a week. And meanwhile, I'm going crazy waiting for Dr. Ozen to get back to me with my test results. <sighs> so what do you think of our new doctor? What do you mean? I just wonder what she's really doing here. Things are heating up here in Prague. We can use all the help we can get. I'd be worried if Interpol didn't send a psychologist. Besides, I spoke to her for an hour. I like her. It just seems suspicious to me, that's all. We've never needed a psychologist before. Who's she watching? Come on, Adam. You keep talking like that, and Chang's gonna change all the locks again. There are 87 agents in Prague, and I just finished handing out the new keycards. How did it go with Dr. Roseanne? She ran some tests? I swear to God, Adam. These tests they give me are more stressful than being in the field. When I'm out there, I have immediate feedback every second. And when you're doing these tests, they just stare at you and take notes. I don't like it. Nobody does. When do you get the results? Dr. Ozen didn't say. I don't know, hopefully in a day or two. Try and stay positive. Always. I should get going. Okay. Talk to you later.
Nice coat. My goodness. If I had a home to go to, I'd be hiding Stay there right now. Stay out of the way. We're securing the area. Better start staying away from the crowd today. Just one more time. That's it. Then I'll get the thing. And then I said, you want how much for this? And then she said, 50 credits. 50! Take care of it. Ah, a customer, right? Over here. What do you want? Hypo stims? Pick up a prescription? If you want Mikel or the doctor, they're not here. I'll take the hypo stims. Here. But that's all I have for now. Who is Mikhail? My nephew. He works here as an assistant, but he didn't show up for work today. His apartment is just across the street. Would it have killed him to let me know he can't come in? Probably not. Especially since you seem like such an approachable boss. Did you come here for something? This place has a doctor. Oh, yes. Dr. Zipra, Mr. Big Shot from Tai Young. Who thinks he's too good for a place like this? Tai Young. What did he do for them? <laughs> he calls it experimental neurotherapy. If he's so good, how come his patient ran away and he can't find her? What does an experimental neurotherapist do, exactly? He is vague about it, and I don't care enough to ask. You want something else? I'll be going. Do what you want. Who listens to that garbage? Na 
What's going on? Clockman's clock is ticking. Good one. Come on, let's blow this place. Hey, I'm the funny guy, not you. Reporting to you live. 
Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Smiley, Stanek wasn't at his apartment, but I did find what looked like bomb-making equipment and a trap set by the Diwali. You're kidding! I also found out where he might be. The Red Light District. At a bar across the street from the Red Queen. I'm heading there now. We have a couple of agents in that district watching the Diwali now. I'll send them over. Copy that.
Nice outfit. You think this crackdown will hurt the business? I know you're gonna sit there quietly and wait with us like a good little watchmaker. I've got this, Major Riley. You and your partner can relax for a few minutes. Wait a minute. I know you. You've been in my shop. What is this? You have some things to answer for, Mr. Stanek. We have evidence linking you and your shop to the train station bombing. Bombing? No! I would never... I, I wouldn't even know where to start. You have the wrong man. Do I? Convince me. I have a timing device with your name on it, and I found the tools to make even more bombs in your apartment. What else am I supposed to think? But you've been to my shop. You know I fix watches. I don't make bombs. No. Those tools aren't mine. They belong to my... Your daughter? No. No. Look. Take me in. I'm the one you're looking for, not her. I... I have made bombs for them. I don't think so. Protecting your daughter is admirable, Mr. Stanek. But you're not doing her any good by taking the blame. You need to tell me what you know. I... You're right, I know. Allison was in the military. She always wanted to belong, to be part of something greater than herself. She was such a beautiful child, gifted. What happened? After the incident, she met some people. They said they were her friends. Well, I could see they only wanted to use her. Parasites, and, and now, now, they have taken her. You must help. She is not to blame for this. She has been coerced. Calm down. What do you mean they've taken her? Allison and I were supposed to meet here tonight. Instead, one of them came by, spewing curses about fleshers and naturals. He gave me a message from her. She was... she was saying goodbye. But she would never... They used her, and now they intend to make her disappear. Your apartment was booby-trapped by Radich Nikoladze. What? Why would he...? I guess friendship means nothing to a thug. What happened? I was never a wealthy man, but my shop is well-known and respected. Radich liked my watches. He knew I needed money after what happened to Allison, so we strike a deal. But deals are like beautiful women to that man. A better one always comes around. What do you know about these friends of hers? Other than they were augmented? Not much. They only spoke to Allison when they came to the shop. As if anyone unaugmented was beneath them. They kept talking about the ascension, whatever that is. Does your daughter have the expertise to do this? Much more than I do. She was in the military. EOD, they called it. Explosive Ordnance Disposal. The bombs what? Yes. She was happy in the military. They augmented her, rebuilt her to make her better at what she did. But 
After the incident, she was dishonorably discharged. She was lost. That's when these new friends found her. Ugh. They exploited her, and now they plan to discard her. Where can I find Allison, Mr. Stanek? I wish I knew. I would go and get her away from those people. I was about to go looking for her when your goon showed up. We'll find her. I need you to go with these agents. I'll have some more questions for you. No! I have to go! I have to help her! She's... She's all I have! Please, let us do our job. Find my daughter, or I will! Smiley, I spoke to Stanek. He's not our guy, but he has a daughter. Allison. Ex-military, EOD. She might be the bomb maker. So what's our next move? Stanek says he doesn't know where she is, but I think he's hiding something. The agents are bringing him in. Until he gives her up, this investigation is stalling. I'll make sure they lean on him. See what he knows. Good. Let me know what happens. I'm not on but I have many friends in How they're doing at the casino. Look at that. I got something. A large cart of Todd's chalk is evident. It'd be nice to find another bottle. Something to keep us safe. Hello? You can't defend against that kind of thing. They always like the guard. Kam se chystáš v těch
Alex. I'm in Miller's apartment. The man keeps a tight ship. What do you expect? He's former SAS. Military life will make a neat freak out of anyone. If he's got secrets in there, Adam, they'll be well hidden. Everyone's gotta tell. I just need to know more about him to understand his. Find anything in that apartment yet? It's like you said, Miller keeps his secrets well hidden. But I'm looking. I think I got something, Alex. Miller's NSN access card. He must have left it behind when he logged into his second computer. His second computer? Anything incriminating on it? Have Yet. But I'm starting to think the only way we'll learn more is by hearing all of that NSN conversation. Shit, man, that's risky. But we may have to. Why? You find something on VersaLife? It ain't good. Meet me in the small courtyard near TF-29. I'll explain.
Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access granted. Bad enough when he was just drugs. Hey, thanks for being quick. Didn't want to be seen hanging around by myself for too long in case you got held up. I can be a gentleman, sometimes. You said you got something on VersaLife. Yeah. A couple of months back, a research assistant was found dead in the Rokaseka Beach facility. Special Projects Division. She was poisoned, just like Rucker. She? You got her name? Anik Norstad. Why? You know somebody there? Doesn't matter. Forget it. I can't stand verse of life, Adam. Back when I was flying for Bell Tower in Panama, I stumbled into deep shit with them. They're the reason I've got a target on my back. They told my bosses to kill me. If they're involved in this, we'll get them. We just need to know what this is. Rucker gave me this before he died. Said it could prove Ark is being set up. The email on it reads like activation orders to me. Where'd he get it? Whose is it? I've got a suspect in mind, but nothing to prove it. Until I do. Can you get Janus or one of your juggernaut friends to backtrace the IP address? Yeah, man, no problem. Listen, about VersaLife. The information we found on Norstat was buried. Deep. No police report, no autopsy. Just a footnote on an insurance claim, calling it an industrial accident. She was working with dangerous pathogens, wasn't she? Supposedly. Janus thinks there's more to it. He's the one who found the report. Said it was... off. Off how? Lots of blank spaces and missing details. Didn't really go into it. And you didn't think to ask, did you? Are you saying I fucked up? I'm saying Janus thinks a lot of things, and somehow always manages to find the answer when nobody else can. You don't find that odd? I find it reassuring. The Collective has people everywhere gathering all kinds of intel. But Janus is what holds us together, helps us make sense of it. He picks the signal out of the static. And yet you've never met him? 
Nobody meets James. Nobody even knows where he is, who he is, hell even what he is. You get used to it after a while. For me, the key thing is what he finds. Norstat was poisoned, Adam, just like Rucker. Are we looking at some kind of bioweapon here? Miller's access card might help us find out. How? I don't follow you. NSN exchanges are stored in the system's cloud memory. If I log in as Miller using his access card, I might be able to play back more of that conversation he had with the bosses. Shit, Adam, this isn't like planting a bug. You have to actually use the chair for a while. If anyone catches you... It's a risk I'm willing to take. Your call. But I want to be plugged in and listening the whole time you're in there. Just be careful, man. Call me when you've accessed the machine. What a place. Oh, hello. Initiated. Access granted. Alex, I'm in. Anything I need to know before I start up this chair? Every NSN is different, man, so I'm not sure what to expect. I'm guessing you'll end up in some kind of virtual conference room. No one else should be in there. And if they are? They'll see you as Miller, so say something snippy and log off. <laughs> okay. Where do I find these stored conversations? Hell if I know. This is your plan. But holographic recordings take up a lot of virtual memory, so you may have to look in several places. I'll just have to play it by ear. Exactly. The whisper chip is still in place, though, so we'll both know when you've done it. Good luck, Adam.
This is different.
Sending your team to Dubai was my call, but now we need to go by the book. Focus on Ark. You want me to pin all of this on them? The bombings in Prague, the break-in at Bursa Life, Dubai? Officially, all five attacks involved augmented terrorists. Is that clear? Yes, sir. But send the reports if you want me to prove it. Because Ark doesn't operate in North America. Please call Hong Kong Alpha One Zero priority message. We've got a problem. Miller wants to see a report on the break-in. What break-in? The one your San Francisco research facility is supposed to have any day now. What? What exactly did you tell him? Never mind. I'll take care of it. In fact, it may even help me clean up a related incident. What have you heard from our man inside Ark? Not much. He has to be careful transmitting. Rucker may be on to him. Then it's time for him to use the Orchid. Tell him. <sighs> Killing Rucker... Are you sure it's a good idea? I mean, it'll certainly make things easier during phase two, but... Are you doubting me, Joseph? I'm merely concerned that the rest of the Council might not like your call. They seem less cohesive these days. Rucker's death may upset some of them. But at this juncture, Brown is the only person we pay attention to. Once Rucker is dead, I'm positive he's going to make his move. Do it! Go. Alex, did you get all that? Hell yeah. Don't tell me this isn't the proof we're looking for, Adam. This is big. Janus needs to hear it. I want to talk to him this time. Set it up. Let me know where. I'll see what I can do. Later, man. Adam, what are you doing in here? My job. What about you? I, I'm sorry that I wasn't questioning you. It was meant to be jovial. Guess I need to work on my timing. Anyway, I'm leaving a message for the director, asking if he's heard from Vince Black, our organized crime division head. Black's still deep undercover inside the Diwali organization, isn't he? The kind of deep that can be hard to swim back from sometimes, yeah. He's supposed to meet with me once a week so I can bring him back into the shallows, only... He never showed for our first meeting. From what I know of the Diwali, their influence extends outside of the Czech Republic. Maybe he's out of town. Maybe. Maybe you could find out? Sorry, Doc, but with everything that's happening right now, my plate's pretty full. No worries. I understand. Well, listen, Adam, Lyon's waiting on my initial batch of reports, and I'm sure Director Miller wouldn't be too pleased to find us standing in his office, so... Unless there's something else, I think this is where I'll check out. You mentioned Lyon is expecting your first batch of reports. You don't answer to Director Miller? I'm a civilian employee, specializing in habituating deep cover operatives. You're not an agent. So why did you choose to work with badges? I started out working for Lim International, helping patients cope with the emotional strain of augmentation. After the incident, I needed to change my focus. Interpol was looking, so I moved my clinic to the public sector. So you answer directly to Joseph Manderley? It was Joe's idea to get a psychological clinic up and running inside our field offices. But listen, Adam, I have a small mountain of agent files to process, so if there isn't anything else... Joe, huh? Sounds like you and Manderly are close. We're close because I used his first name? Well, you said you joined TF-29 after the incident. 
I assume that maybe you and Manderly started together when the task force was launched. No, no, no. I arrived after Joe did. Look, Adam, we should probably get out of here, don't you think? Yeah, you're probably right. I am curious, though, where Manderly came from exactly. Heard he jumped over quite a few heads to get to the big chair at TF-29. Must have some pretty influential friends pulling strings. Why the interest in our boss? I'd just like to know who everyone is. If Joe had help, I'm sure it was from people who share his vision for what this task force could become. Anyway, listen, I really do think it's best if we get out of Miller's office before he returns, so if you'll excuse me... The original digital Robin Hood. When he got pinched, the task force made him a deal. Work for us, or go to jail. Pretty easy terms for a guy like Chang. I heard rumors Hex was tied in with the government. Adam, you came back. Hex was totally independent. But Chang hates the collective. Says they're nothing but terrorists. Probably some. They're ghosts, they so bring them down with a huge challenge. <laughs> Fletcher, you are a genius. Can't believe a word they say. Adam, Janus heard the NSN conversation we recovered. He agrees you two should meet. Good. Just tell me where. There's an abandoned tourist information center in the central plaza. Make sure you're not followed. And I got something on Marchenko for you too. Details are on a pocket secretary near the meetup point. Look for a trash bin with a chalk mark above it. You'll find it near the metro. Got it. Can't defend against that kind of thing. Seems as though there are more.
police than usual. Uh, really? I, I, I would not know. I, I am not usually an officer. It's not at the office. We have a deadline in a few days, and there is so much to get done before then. I do not think we will make it. Anomaly detected. Trace program initiated. Access denied. Anomaly detected. Access granted. Janus, if this is your idea of a face-to-face -face meeting, I'm not impressed. You didn't think I would jump on a plane to Prague, did you? I guess not. That conversation we recovered, you know who Manderley was talking to, don't you? Robert Page, CEO of Page Industries and owner of the First Life Corporation. He's a multi-billionaire. Doesn't mean we can't arrest both of them for conspiracy to commit murder. We heard Page give the order to kill Rucker. In a recorded conversation that you obtained illegally. It's fruit from the poisonous tree, Mr. Jensen. It won't stand up in court. What about this orchid, then? Can we find out more about it? I think we should find out. I'm digging on my end, but there may be something you can do in Prague. First Life has an account at the Palisade Property Bank. If you can get to their data vault, we may find some of the answers we're looking for. You're telling me to break into a bank? Ark is being manipulated, set up to take the fall for something. Most likely another terror attack. Fine. What about this Brown? Page mentioned him and some sort of council. 
Nathaniel Brown, maybe, head of the Santo Group? Perhaps. Nathaniel Brown stands to earn trillions if the Human Restoration Act passes, but... Janus. Adam, the site's been compromised. I just spotted sentry drones headed your way. What? How? I wasn't following. Maybe somebody at PRE detected Janus's hack into the electrical grid. I don't know. Just get out of there. Hey you, with the sunglasses, come here. Hey, what do you need? Is that all the info you need? Excellent choice. Sophisticated choice. I'm finished for the day. You've taken everything I had. Mr. Jensen, it's Nomad Stanek. Please, please, you must help. Mr. Stanek, how did you... My daughter, they're going to kill her. I gave your friends the slip, and when... When I got to here... Where? The Prakaska district, and I'm part 
apartment complex behind the laundromat. Please hurry. Ten hajzl leze do řítí a dostane povýšení. 